All right, what's up, YouTube? Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Welcome back, welcome back, everyone. Welcome back. I know you guys haven't seen us in a while. Happy New Year. Happy New Year's, everyone. But I'm not even gonna say too much, but just know that you guys are gonna be seeing us way more this year. This year is full of consistency, growth, more content, all 2023. So just know that you guys are gonna see way more from us and nice. We're back. But for everybody who's not subscribed watching this video, hit that subscribe button. We're back, so hit the subscribe button. As you can see by the title, we're going to be doing Truth or Drink. It's been really popular lately, and we haven't done this ever yet, so I'm excited. But for the people who don't know what Truth or Drink is, it's basically we're going to be answering questions. Whoever don't want to answer has to take a shot, and whoever wants to answer the truth tells the truth and don't got to take a shot. So that's basically how you play. So what we're gonna be taking shots of here is we got rum chata. Rum chata is just like a slight drink, not really Somewhat. like, yeah, we're not really in the mood to drink. I didn't wanna get like a bottle bottle because I didn't wanna do that. Yeah, and, crazy <laughs> and I'm here to tell the truth, nothing but the truth. If I really didn't wanna answer because I just don't wanna tell my business, then I'll take a shot, but I'm here to answer and tell the truth, so. I like that energy. That but before we start this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn your post notifications on so you guys can get notified every time you drop a brand, brand new video. Because you guys are going to see a lot of more videos from us this year, like I said. So, let's get into this video. Let's go. I got 20, 20 to 25 questions here. So, that's what we're going to be working with. 20 to 25 questions. How we're going to do it is... We're both gonna answer the same question. So I'm gonna be asking the question, but we're both gonna answer. He's just gonna answer first. So like, I'm gonna ask him, he's gonna answer, and then I'm gonna answer. So we're, we're gonna basically be answering the same question. So whoever don't wanna answer, we take the shot, right? Yes, whoever don't wanna tell the truth or don't wanna answer, takes a shot. But before we start this video, we're gonna start off with a shot. That's how you do it. You know, I'm not ready. Oh, my, my, my hand is slippery. Yeah, this drink is like, it tastes like coquito to us. It's basically, it basically is. I usually mix this with Fireball. Yeah. All right. I got water next to me too, just in case, because the cheers to the first shot. So. so the first question is, if given a free pass, what celebrity would you do it with? Like, do it, do it with. Like, meaning I wouldn't get mad or you wouldn't get broken up with. Anybody? Could be anybody? Probably get Ariana Grande. Ew. She was cuter back then, but I don't think. <laughs> um, I for me. I always liked her, so. For me. Spire. Little Dirk. The next question is, what's a non-sexual thing that the other turns you on? So what's a non-sexual thing that I do that turns you on? To be honest, I have a lot. <laughs> I have a lot on my mind, but I'm just gonna stay quiet for that one. I'm gonna take a shot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not put too much out there, but I'll take a shot. For me, something that's non-sexual that turns me on about him, it's probably like when he does like little things that I don't ask, like gets me my favorite snack without me asking, or takes me like to, I don't know, takes me places like, and surprises me. Like let's say we're in the car driving and he just drives to my favorite place I like to get dessert at. Like, yeah, I have something in my mind, but I'm just gonna keep that for myself. Right. I'll take the shot though. Next question. The next question is, who's more freaky? Me. Probably her. Yeah, I'll say her. Yeah. More freaky. Yeah. I think that. all girls are probably the most freakiest, but there's some guys out there that's just like. But yeah. But me. The freakiest, freakiest, probably her. Yeah, me. Um, the next question is Would you get your significant other's name tatted? I would. I wouldn't. You wouldn't? Why not? Because I, f I heard that that ruins the relationship. You ever heard that myth that's that like bad. if you get somebody's name on you, it ruins your relationship? That's bad. You would? I mean, I would, yeah. When? 
probably like on my wrist. But I'm saying like when would you chest? get it? Oh, on know. your chest? Like a, like right here or something? You would do that? Deja leaves. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Stop the cap. <laughs> Are you lying? Because you don't want to be lying. I'd probably put it in my wrist. But like, when, when would when would you want to get married? Probably whenever we get married. Oh, so like it has to be a married yeah, thing? Yeah, like either, mar what, either when we're married or we got kids. I probably would get like a symbol. I don't know. I just, I don't trust getting the name. I just don't want anything to mess up. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I probably would, but. I would. I don't know. We'll see. The next question is, what's a pet peeve about each other? Do you want me to go first? Mm. My pet peeve about him <laughs> is that sometimes he don't want to do anything. Like he just is not motivated. He don't want to do nothing. He don't want to go anywhere. Like he could literally stay in bed all day and not eat. Just stay there all day and just waste his day away. Sleep till like nine o'clock at night. I'm just trying to, I just want to chill. There's days for that, but like, I uh, sometimes, and I don't, I think it's kind of my fault because I don't have my license yet. All I have is my permit. Working on getting my license, I just don't want to drive next to a stranger. That's just in my mind. And I'm not totally confident in driving in the streets yet because people drive crazy. Okay. Yeah, but you're going to have to one day. One and day. just not drive forever. Obviously, I'm going to drive. I mean, you drive. can, but that's up drive. to you. 2023, I'm going to try to get my license. But, and yeah, that's just my pet peeve about him. Like, if I if he don't want to do anything, I'm stuck here too. We're not, we're never going to do anything because he just don't want to do anything. That's my pet peeve. I just be lazy. But one, one of my pet peeves of you is when you get your nails done or you do your nails, you always click clacking your damn nails everywhere you go. In the car, we could be out shopping. You're always like click clacking, click clacking. That really bothers you? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I just don't say nothing. But yeah, that's a pet peeve of mine. The girls that but get it, get it. The girls that don't, click don't. Right now. They're click clacking right now and not even doing Sometimes they, they just do it when I'm talking, like. It's probably a habit, too. Sometimes you just be like, you don't yeah. be noticing. You just be click like them. Yeah, but yeah, that's my pet peeve. Okay. Next question is, is there anything that turns you off about each other? Is there anything that turns you off about me that I do? Mm, mm, yeah. Yes. 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 <laughs> The way he acts sometimes, he's just like, I don't sometimes know. Sometimes when we have disagreements, yeah, like, it could be something simple, like, where are we going to eat today? And if she don't get what she wants, it's a whole big deal and an issue. Now I'm turned off and I'm mad and we're arguing. Not, not really arguing, arguing, but disagreeing with each other and just going back and forth. Like, Bro, if, I, if I'm not getting what I want to eat, we're not eating. I, I mean... Like, how... I, what do you mean? Like, if I want to get something to eat today, and if I don't want if to eat that? you want something, and I want something. Okay. And now we both got to decide what we want. And if you don't get what you want, now it's a whole issue. But we right? usually want the same thing, so that doesn't make sense. That's true, but sometimes, you know, I want something that I want that you don't like. It could be Burger King, it could be McDonald's, and if you're not in the mood, that so day we could, get it. So we could simply go to se separate places, which we do all the time. Yeah, but sometimes I don't want to drive to that one place because it's further than the place I want to eat, so... That's what turns me off. It's ruined my whole day. No, what turns me off is exactly what he was saying, but the opposite, like how he acts. You get me food all the time. It's not basically me getting what I want, but if I can't get what I want to eat, ew. Like, what do you mean? But you can get what you want to eat because you could drive there, right? You always get what you want to eat, though, so. I know I do. So the times that I don't, it's stupid. Who wants to eat Burger King? I don't even like, I don't like nothing from Burger King. Yeah, you do. You like Walker Jr. So. That's out of the question, but yeah. Next question. That's just, yeah. Next question. Would you cheat for a billion dollars? Yes. <laughs> and give you half. <laughs> you would do that? Mm -hmm. I would do that too. We're Guys, just, we're in a relationship that we don't care. We just like, cheat on each other and just give each other half. We love each other to death, oh, wow. but like, I mean, cheating kind of ruins the relationship though, because I know that you did it with another You girl. really cheat though? I was just joking, being sarcastic, but you really cheat? You weren't being sarcastic. You were yes, being. I was. You were being for real. Why would I cheat on you and give you half? Like one billion dollars? You ain't gonna be with me. How would you? I say this. Would you let me cheat on you? And yeah. then us keep the money. Obviously, you're still. So gonna would be you let me cheat on you and us keep the money? Yeah, a billion dollars. 
That's why I said yeah. Do what you gotta do. Now with Once just, we get that money. With just anybody? No. Like it would have to be something that somebody that I actually wanna do it with. But I wouldn't wanna do it with anybody else because I'm with you. So it's kinda like weird. And I wouldn't I wouldn't like I, mean, I, would, I wouldn't be fair though, because if you wanna do it with somebody you wanna do it with, that wouldn't really like make sense. They gotta give you just somebody random and you just gotta cheat on me. Like the first question was if we got a free pass to do it with any celebrity, who would you do it with and why? No, who would you do it with? I said Little Dirk, you say Ariana Grande, but like I wouldn't really do it with Little Dirk. Like I just said that because I'm never gonna meet him one day and never gonna do it with him. Yeah, if like, I had the chance for Ariana Grande, I probably would. <laughs> but yeah. He's, he's uh, like Ariana Grande. But in reality, I would. That depends. If we agree on it, it's a billion dollars. Like, come on. Like after I've done cheating on you, now we're rich. I take it back. I would not do it with Little Dirk. I would do with Rihanna. Rihanna? She bad. I would do with Rihanna. That's the only person I would go get for. Rihanna. She a little baddie. Anyway, next question. <laughs> um, truth or drink? Am I the prettiest girl you ever dated? Hell yeah. <laughs> Period. She's and the obviously you're the cutest. Not cutest, but like. Why you say it like that? <laughs> What do you mean? Right, it is over. It is over, guy. That's it. Because <laughs> <laughs> I was, I wasn't gonna say prettiest. I was about to say this. Uh, I okay, said cutest. Oh, cutest. But yeah, I've never really had like real, real relationships before. So yeah. he's obviously the cutest. I'm the bestest I've ever been with. He knows that. You're the prettiest I've ever been with, to be honest. Next question: What's the worst thing you said to a family member or friend about each other? So what's the worst thing you said to me? What's the worst thing you said about me to a friend or family member when we were mad at each other? That's a good he be one. talking a lot of shit. No, I know I he does. I don't be talking shit. He used to. That's a good question though. Cause I probably did talk shit before, but. I did. All right, so you go first. Probably just saying that, I don't wanna, mm, I don't know. Like just saying that I'm tired of the way he acts and he needs to step up his game. You know, stuff like that. Like, stuff when you're mad and you're arguing about something. I keep clocking my nails now that you said that. Stuff See? when we get mad at each other, it's just like. That's normal. I be like, yeah. But I really Sometimes can't he ain't shit. Sometimes da 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 da. <laughs> but I know a, there's times that you were like, I don't want to be with her no more. I'm going to take a shot because I really can't like think of it. He probably can. He just. Nah. He smokes too much. Yeah, I do smoke too much. I'm gonna just take the shot. Like it does taste like coquito. It does. It's just strong, right? Yeah. Yeah. That's like a little bit more like alcohol taste. Yeah. Next question. Have you ever thought yeah. about breaking up? Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I only took like one shot, right? I'm gonna answer everything. It's like. No, I said three shots. Nah, I'm joking. Um, no, I dead ass have. Nah, I haven't to be honest. I have. When? When I just get mad. Guys, this is my birth control, I think. It's just like when I really, really get mad, I'll be like, I don't want to be with him no more. Like, I don't want to be with him no more. I don't want to be with him no more. I don't want to deal with it. I'm over it. These are weird. Though. No, it's just the Taurus in me. I get, like, we just mad tend bipolar. to not give a, like, we just tend not, not to give a fuck. He's bipolar. I am bipolar. Me not. I never really. That's you're such a liar. You're talking about that when I piss you off or we're having a bad day and you're like over me. I'm talking about because there's times that we haven't talked all day. That's because... not talking all day. I'm not thinking about breaking up with you though. Oh. I'm just talking, not talking all day. I'm not like that. I want to break up where she's not. Like, no. I mean, I think that, but I get over it. Like, but there's times that I have thought about it. Like I just don't want to be with anymore. <laughs> I guess. I don't know if it's a girl thing, but she loves me. She ain't gonna go anywhere. Anyways, next question. Next question. Why did your last relationship end? <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't know. I don't think uh, I want to answer this because it's. I don't have a like a real answer, and I don't want to talk about it. I have an answer. For I don't really answer. consider myself being in a relationship, anyways. My so. last relationship wasn't really working. 
I fell out of I fell out of love with her. So why don't you explain? Tell the people, tell our subscribers why you fell out. No, I don't want to explain all that, but they, you gotta to tell them. Honest, no, to you honest, gotta tell them the tea. Yeah, nah, I'm gonna tell them. To be honest. Cheers. When I went to school, when I was going to school, that's obviously I met her in like eleventh grade. While I was going out with my last relationship, that girl, or whatever. I met her and that was it. I fell in love with her, to be honest. We went on a little date, Stony Park, and I was like, you know what? I like this girl more. So I just went with you. That's cute. I didn't want to say all that, but it is what it is. I'm not trying to take another shot. They want to know the tea. Which yeah. is not really tea. It's didn't... like a basic, you know. I just didn't love her no more, that's it. Damn. But, um, next question. <laughs> <laughs> have you ever thought I was ugly? Bro, you know how many bad days I have? You know how many bad days I have. My and hair's that... not done. Haven't brushed my teeth. Been in bed all day. You're never ugly to me. Oh. You're being cute for this video, guys. He's being too... I'm not being cute, I'm being honest. He's being too... Nice and cute for y'all. I'm not, but I never thought you was ugly either. That's cut. Never. I tell you, you that. Know. You he he knows that. Cause there's times he hasn't got a haircut. Sorry, that'd be back wealthy. then, like I'm talking about COVID days when everything was closed for weeks and he didn't get a haircut for like a month. Yo, I remember. A month or two months, and I never no, thought he was ugly. I think it was longer. It was like three, four months. Cause all the barber shops were closed. Perfect. Mad That's long. what I'm saying. So I, I had a whole bunch of hair, my beard. I had a whole beard. I just look bad, messy. Like I never. Thought I know how we ugly. get. We don't get a cut in a while. He must. You must have thought that he. You were ugly, and I think that I'm ugly like all the time. Not ugly. I just look. I mad. mean, I don't think I'm ugly all the time. I just think that I have bad days. Like I'm not looking my best one day. But now to answer the question, no, no for me. Yeah, no for me. Either. Cute. Next question. What's one habit you wish each other got rid of? So what's one habit you wish I got rid of? My hab one, my bad habit I wish you got rid of is laziness. Same and, for you. And unmotivationness. Same for you. You're Just more lazy. I'm lazy. Bro, you're, you're lazy more too. lazy than me. You're no, more lazy than me. I mean. Yes. You're still lazy though. No. If I'm being lazy, you're gonna be lazy. Exactly. And so if I want to not be lazy, you still want to be lazy. So we both got to work on that. That's it. 2023. No more laziness for 2023. It's going to be hard, but... You guys heard it here first. No more laziness. Period. Facts. We got to go. We got to go to... For the people who watched us before, you guys know that we went to the gym. We trying to go back to the gym again. As well. That when we were living in Florida, we used to go to the gym every single day. Monday through Friday. No days off. I mean, obviously, Saturday and Sunday were off, but Monday through Friday, straight working out. And we were eating good. We were eating, like, okay. But we were eating good. There was a point where we were just eating salads for, every, like, every single day. Remember that? Yeah. Straight salad. I was trying to get skinny mini, and I'm trying to get there again. Okay, next question. What's something that would make you do it on the first date? So, let's say, like, you met anybody. Like, let's say you're single, and I'm single. What would make you want to do it with them the first night that you guys link? Like, what would make you want to do it with them the first night? <clears throat> Probably how she acting, like... How would she have to when act? When she's giving me signals and hints that she's trying to do it. Man. So you would do it on the first night just because she's giving you signals? She's touching me all crazy, or she's... <laughs> she always a freak, bro! She's just doing something. And he's like, trying to say, I'm not a freak, but he's... He definitely just said it. He's, she's touching me all crazy, like, what? I don't know. Like, she's giving me hints. No, for me, I, I wouldn't do it on the first night. Mm -mm, I, wouldn't, I, would. I wouldn't do it on the first night. It yeah, all depends. boys are because boys are whores. It depends. Of course, they're going to do it the first night. It just depends. <laughs> Us girls actually have class. I'm not doing it on the first night. I don't care if you're touching me all crazy. If you're telling me everything I want to hear in the world, no. I just, I'm not going to do it with you unless you're my boyfriend. I like that. Yeah, I'm not doing it on the first day. You should know me by now. Because we didn't, we didn't do it on the first day. <laughs> Enough said. <laughs> oh, like six years ago. Oh, yeah. Okay. Next question. Have it? Have you ever thought that my friends were cute? Ever? Like, oh, she's pretty. Like, she's cute. Like, wow, she's mad pretty. 
Like, any I will of, slap the shit out of you. Any of your friends? Yes. Like, oh, like, I brought them over and you're like, oh, shit, like, she's mad for me. You're lying because you thought about that. You I, if I was lying, I would have took the shot. No, yeah. if you were lying, you would have said no. I'm saying I no. mean, if you were lying, you would have not took that long to answer. If it was no, you would have just said no. I'm saying no. But why did you take that long to answer? Because I was thinking. That's a truth or drink. Either you tell the truth or you take the shot. I never thought his friends were cute. Never. Not. Ever. Not just because I'm with him, just because. Even if I did, I would tell you. I'm not saying no just because it's the, the video. Right. I'm saying no because. No. You don't got no cute friends, to be honest. Yeah, I do. You just did shit and think that they're cute. I mean, I don't have friends right now, but I'm just saying, like. If I, I did. Have past friends. <laughs> if I did, <laughs> he shouldn't think that they're cute, anyways. Next question. Lights on or off? Off. It's obvious. Yeah, lights off. <laughs> hey, whoever does it with the lights on, you're a weirdo. No. Yeah. There's some people who like to see everything when it's going on. Yeah, you're right, but. Yeah. I just feel like that's weird. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I mean, there's times that we did do it with the light on, but it's just like, it's not weird because we're used to each other, but it's just like, damn, your faces that you're making, like, he see everything, yeah, but. it's not the same. There's times that, you know, yeah, yeah. But lights off. Is lights weird. off. Lights off. What's your favorite position? Me on the bottom. Me on top. <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> Anyways, next. Next question. Is there something I cooked that you didn't like? Is there something I ever cooked that you didn't like? Don't lie. Nah. There's something that I ever cooked you that you were like, damn, I don't like this, but I'm not gonna tell her because I don't want to hurt her feelings. Nah. You know you cook bomb. <laughs> she's, she's really good with cooking. So nah. Everything you cooked me, that shit was fire. And Jensen don't cook, so. Yeah, I don't cook. I can't say the Nor same. Nor do I want to cook. You, he should know. I'm not cooking. You should learn. I just feel like it's not for me. Like, I'm not being in the kitchen. Yeah, you just, shit. yeah. No, I wouldn't even trust him in the kitchen anyways. So, whatever. Yeah, I'd be too paranoid with the stoves and the ovens. Like, I'm good with that. Last question. I might look up more questions because this video seems too short. But, last question for now. Have you ever lied about where you was at and why? Before? Like, doesn't matter, like, at any time? While we, while we were together. Like, while you're together? Oh, while well, we're together. No lie, because you probably did. Probably did, but I can't remember. I know. Like, that's what I'm trying to remember when, but... I mean, I think I did. No, I never did. Yeah, you did. When? I was like... A few years ago. When? <clears throat> when I was working at McDonald's, remember? Oh my god, I did not lie. Right? I forgot where you told me you was, but... I was home. You said you were home, taking a shower, but in reality... No, I like, said I was about to get in the shower. Yeah, whatever. And you were with your sister-in-law. I think you were... I don't know what she She picked doing. me up to go to the store quick for the girls, because she was by herself, and my brother was working at the mall. And she didn't want to go by herself with the two girls that she had. And she was pregnant, I think. Now she wasn't pregnant. But she wanted me to go with, but Jensen's at work. Like, I'm not going to tell him every little clock move that I do. Like, if I'm getting picked up to go to the store quick, why do I have to tell you that? So why are you, so telling, like, me, why are you telling me you're going to hop in the shower? But I was a, I was about to hop in the shower before she hit me up to go to the store with her. And you got picked up. Okay. And you still didn't tell me. But why do I have to tell you that? If it's gonna be a you got to tell me. If it's going to be a quick little pickup, why do I have to let you know that? still gotta let me know what if something, yeah guys and he thought i was at a boy's house doing something what if something happened to you like i'm with my it sister it doesn't matter you could get in a car crash anything but you're telling me you're hopping in the shower now i'm not getting no answers at all and now you would have been tight if my brother or somebody picked me up and i didn't tell you and you were at work there's times that you did do that and i didn't know about it that's not the point all right anyways. so don't make it excuses anyways anyways yeah. So you never did? Because you're talking all this shit for I me. I said I probably did. But I oh, but you can't remember. I just can't remember. So take a shot. I gotta take a shot. Yes, remember. because you can't remember. Shot o'clock. Shot o'clock. This bottle's almost gone. I can't really see it on camera. But... I took two shots. 
How many shots are you on right now? What is that? Four. Are you keeping that with your thing. Eye? Four. <laughs> uh, three, four, I don't know. All right, well, while he's taking that shot, I'm gonna try to look up like five more questions and come back. So I'll be back when I get more questions. Okay, I'm back with some questions. So the next question is, what are you most insecure about? Me? Probably my teeth and my teeth. And sometimes the breakouts on my face make me insecure. And sometimes my stomach. That's good. I'm not even gonna lie, I can't feel it. Here to take another one? Oh. No, no, I'm just saying, like, I'm not a drinker, so. Yeah. And I took, like, four shots, I think. Four shots. I don't know. It'll probably be up here. What I'm take insecure about, to be honest, probably these birthmarks that I got right here. What? Those are the cutest like, thing on your these, face. These two birthmarks, like, I mean, you really never, you never see nobody with birthmarks on their nose, but, like. I just feel like it's weird having just two birthmarks right here. No, that's so cute. That's so different. I think so. I don't know. Sometimes I just be like, why are they on my face? But yeah, that's what I'm in kind of insecure about, to be honest. Hmm. The next one. Do you, do you have a secret that I never known about you? Or that you, that you don't know about me? Do you have a big secret that you, I don't know about? You want me to go first? No. No. I don't have one. No, really. I've, we don't really like hold secrets. I've basically told you my whole yeah. life and more, so. No. No. Don't. We tell each other everything. No. Out of all the friends you've had in the past, which one don't you like? So out of all the friends you ever had, which one do you least like? And you have to say the name. I'm gonna just take a shot. <laughs> um, I gotta take a shot too. Pour me up. I just set myself up for Pour that one. Up. But it was an interesting question. That is a good okay. question. Okay. Damn, I spilled it. Yeah, but... he's making a mess. I'm gonna just take a shot for that question. He set me up with this it shot. It is what it is. Cheers. But that's like your second shot. Right? My third. Third? Maybe it's like my fifth. But, but. I lie. set myself up with that one, but. I'm not gonna lie, but I'm trying to mass move. Yeah. I feel like when you add it with Fireball, that's what gives it like the little kick. Yeah, because Fireball's spicy. It's not really spicy, but it's just has Her that. mom was the, the one put me on. It's rum chata and fireball. It's fire. Yeah. Fireball's fire. <laughs> <laughs> Did anybody ever kiss you in the past and you hated it? And why? So did you did you ever have a like a kiss in the past that you didn't like? And why? No. Mm, probably I, did. Yeah, I probably did too. Probably in middle school. Like you know at middle school, like when you flirt with somebody, like I did. Let me go first. I right. did. Just because it's probably because either I didn't know how to kiss or they didn't know how to kiss. But kissing is normal. But I just feel like they were doing too much. Now you're talking about like a, just like. Or like yes. Just but, like staying there kissing. But they were doing. Making out. They were trying to make out and I wasn't trying to do that. And they were doing too much. Like, you know when people kiss too much? Like, too back to back to back to back. Yeah, I wasn't with it. And it's not because I was young. But it's just because. They weren't doing it. Right? For me, it was in middle school. I told you about that girl in middle school, right? Yeah. But, yeah, some girl. The only reason why I didn't like the kiss was because it was forced. Like, we knew that we liked each other, but you know how everybody, like, in your oh, yeah, classroom you gasses me. it up and stuff? Like, yeah, you told me about that. And they were like, yo, kiss that girl. When we go to lunch, kiss her and shit. And I was like, nah, bro, I'm not trying to kiss her. Like, at that time, I was kind of shy. So, like, He's I'm not just going to come up to her and just give her a kiss. You know what I mean? He's but she wanted it. I know she wanted a kiss from me, but... I was like, no. And then, I guess we were walking through the hallways and we were holding hands and they were like, yo, 
they all came in a crew and they were like yo give her a kiss right now and they did you dirty yeah they were like yo kiss right now and i was like bro why are you doing this right and then i guess i guess she was shy too because like her face was turning a little red and she was just like blushing but she wanted a kiss from me ew so but yeah <laughs> and then we just kissed and it was like a quick like what ew in front of everybody watching you that's weird but, I'll be like, bro, I'm not kissing him just because y'all are telling me. And it was kind of weird because, like I said, it was forced. Like, we didn't do it at our own time, you know what I mean? Like, they yeah. had, they just told us to kiss. And it was like a quick kiss. L friends. Yeah, facts. Because you want him to kiss his girl on his own time. Why are you forcing him to kiss? That's... You shouldn't even be in their business like that. That's how middle schoolers are, though. Yeah, you know, I know. You used to be in middle school. You know, you used to be in everybody's business. They'll be in your business. Like, oh, yeah. Last but not least... Question. Girl, you said that last question was the last question. This is the last question. And it's a good question. <laughs> I probably know your answer already, but it's a good question. Who cooks better? Me or my mom? <laughs> that was a good question. My mom hasn't really like cooked everything for you that I've Yeah, but your mom about. cooks fine. Your mom, you know your mom cooks good. Who cooks better, me or my mom? You haven't cooked in a while. It doesn't matter. You you tasted all the foods that I cooked for you. For me to answer that question, like um, you're gonna have to be like one on one cook off, like. And I know. Me and my mom been talking about that. If you guys yeah. want to see that, what? comment down, comment down below because me and my mom are dead ass trying to have a cook off. A cook off. Like I'm talking mom. about, she cooks her rice her way, and I cook my rice my way. And I rate it. And I cook my chicken my way, and she cooks her chicken her way. Cause we do supposedly we do everything different. Yeah, I'm going to take a shot for that one because I can't really decide. But. What? I thought that he was going to say me. No offense because we had this conversation before, Mom, and he said me. But now, I did? for the camera, he's ducking. He wants to take a shot. So, take a Not shot. Not ducking, but I guess. I'm not saying I don't know just because we're making a video. I just need to have that one-on-one. -on -one. Like, I need her mom to cook for me, and I need you to cook for me, and I gotta rate it then and there. And just tell y'all, y'all faces who cook better, so. It's gonna be me. My mom's swear, and me and my mom. I mean, she's the OG, she's right, she's the OG. Like, she's the one who taught me some of my tricks, because I'm kind of self-taught, but um. You got your own way of doing things. Right? Yeah but she's always gonna say her because she's been doing this longer than me which does not matter there's people that i cook better and they're grown ass people facts so i don't want to hear that <laughs> <laughs> i don't want to hear that so yeah all right guys so that was the end of the video as you can see i don't know if you could see but i was the one that mostly drank this halfway but i have no shame in my game i told the truth I'm not gonna lie that was just like fun i liked it yes uh, if you guys want a part two let us know down below comment down below i hope you guys enjoyed this video i'm so glad we're back don't be shy to comment down below either if you yeah. got an idea or you just too shy to comment just let us know and we'll come out with the video it's better to hear what you guys want to see like we want to give you guys what you guys want to see so yeah comment down know. below but like i said we're so glad to be back don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Like always, turn your post notifications on so you guys can get notified every time we drop a brand new, new video. video. Don't forget to hit oh. that subscribe button too if you guys are new here. My name is Deja, his name is Jensen. Get to know us, subscribe down below. All 2023 new content, period. Facts. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Princess Deja Lise and at Jensen Santos. And stay tuned for our next video. Peace.